Congratulations. Casey, if you had to sleep with one, which one would it be? How can you even tell them apart? Oh, finally. <laughs> Hairball. Because of you dicks, I have been a cat for so long. Do you know where this tongue has been? Places. What if this is who I am now? Really? This is who you are. Fuzzy throws and fluffy pink slippers. I like my pink fluffy slippers. And a rock of my sweet baby James. <laughs> Do you accept the Thania and Tetradrum? Seriously? What is wrong with you? Nate? What the hell are you doing here? And why aren't you wearing pants? I can explain. And thank you for not mentioning the shower cap. Pretend I did. Coconut oil makes my hair more buoyant. Really? Mm -hmm. I should try that. Agent of the damned, show yourself, you fetid creature. Show yourself, you cursed beast. Reveal your hideous form. Hello. What in the Disney hell is this? Here. It's a donut. I love you. Look. Many wonders indeed. The rest of us go in search of whatever is wreaking havoc on gay Perry. I thought that was uh, impolitically correct. Politically incorrect. Oh, I'm glad you're up here. No, wait. I mean, I don't give a damn if you're up here, and I certainly don't trust you lot in helping me face Nero, no matter how many gold team pep talks you give. Well, you can't keep me down. <clears throat> Actually, ever since I met you, I sometimes lie awake at night staring into the dark, thinking I am it, and it is me. Also, I don't think Han shot first. I'm gonna go sit up front. Also, I used a strategy guide to beat the Water Temple and Legend of Zelda. Also, I really like Gluten. Well, I think it's a cool look, but the whole loosened tie is a little try -hard. Yeah, well, you know, it's not like I went loosened it myself. <laughs> yeah, well, at least I can go make up my own silly superhero names like Atom and Heat Wave. Like, I care what you think. <laughs> I want to grow my hair out and look like Fabio. Oh, yeah, I think that would be good. What's wrong, Ray? Huh? You were hoping to see Nora here. <gasps> you like her, Ray Ray? No, no, I do not like Nora. Uh-huh, because you love her. No, oh, no. The only reason I ever want to see Nora Dark again is so that I can take the time stone back and I can lock her up in the time bureau. Oh my god, she's here. Duty calls. Mm. Apologies, Lord Remington. We'll be on our way shortly. Here. <clears throat> Not a word. Was that a courtesy? <laughs> Only my pride. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Shut up. A damsel. Ah, yeah. oh, hold it up. Up a bit. More. That's the money. I'm not a bloody legend. I'm merely offering my services as a consultant, and as such, I have some stipulations. I don't do silly costumes. I expect full benefits, and I require no less than two weeks' pay vacation. Vacation? Paid. Oh, we may take my coat, but you will never take no. mine. And lose the tie. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Fine. One time. But it's only for the kids. Yeah. Don't let the suit fool you. Our oh, man's a punk. He drove on the wrong side of the road the whole way here. I did? <laughs> nice. Ray, look straight ahead. Talk straight in your newspaper. No one will suspect a thing. 
Yeah. Hi. Uh, wow. You decided to keep the shapeshifter because... Oh. To exploit her for information about the interdimensional prison that she's been trapped in to help us track down other fugitives. That is exactly what we are doing. 100%. Isn't that right? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm gathering that intel as we speak. Mm. I love the initiative team. Yeah. I love summer camp. Everyone used to call me kid counselor. But you took that as a compliment too, didn't you, mate? Well, because of my leadership skills, obviously. <laughs> Right? That's why. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Did you put butter in the coffee machine again, Gary? Mm -hmm. Yes. Right, right. I feel like I should uh, do something, like uh, maybe a distraction? Just wait. This will go a lot faster if you just do your thing, Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> his van already. That's why we're here, innit? Give him a minute. Nick, you're right. He's just a dog walker now. Go and ask for the corgi. What we need are snipers on that ridge line, spotters on the ground, and an exfil site for when we bag the creature. It's not about plan, Sharpie. I'll put a protection spell around the perimeter to keep up the nasties. Best offense is a strong defense. <laughs> are you two kidding me right now? Ava? You're a clone from the future. And you run the Time Travel Bureau. And you're a witch. <laughs> and you escaped a cult. <laughs> a real life team. I did. You two are like the two coolest women I have ever met. And I once met Jillian Anderson at an X-Files meet and greet. Wow. But it's still daytime. It will feel like nighttime when your eyes are closed. Now move. Very nice. You schmoozed me. Did it work? We'll be cruising at a high altitude on our way to save a bake off in Britain. Woo! Yeah. yeah. Jerry, is that the kid's steel costume? Uh huh. You like it? Why would anyone wish to be a sidekick? Close your legs. Oh, he's such an idiot. What? Oh, <laughs> nothing. They're just teasing you. Oh. You're my Dare Bear. We're going to have so much fun. OK. Mick got turned too, but where's he? I love you. I love you too. Really? I thought you were dead. I thought you were dead on the inside. Close door means stay out. Sorry, Sarah called a team meeting. Were you? Yes. I was watching porn. On a typewriter? You sure I can't interest you in a coffee, tea? Fizzy water? Just the validation. I think you're doing a great job. Validation. I told you no interrupt. Well, you're not Gary. Perceptive. And those are not work shoes. What are you doing here? Don't play coy with me. <laughs> Happy birthday, Director Sharp. Oh, sweet God. Um, wow. You know that I don't normally like to celebrate my birthday, but... Well, I am here to fix that, so close your eyes. What? I said close your eyes. OK, OK. Are you ready for your birthday present? Yes. Are we really doing this? Oh! Director Sharp, we need to talk. Of course, sir. I, I was just uh, meditating. There's this great app that... Meditate on this. Oh, my god. Exactly. These are expenses generated by the crew of the Wave Rider, the tip of the Time Bureau spear. Mm -hmm. Your legends. 
You said they were worth the additional funding. Let me refer you to some of my favorite line items. $135 million for a new time core. What was wrong with the old one? Oh, well, um, Rip blew it up when he sacrificed his life to save the world. Sacrifice is right. $1.7 million for historical costumes. Mm-hmm. Well, it, admittedly, their costumes are flamboyant. <laughs> a line item for, and I quote, assorted condiments. <laughs> assorted. No one ever accused the legends of starving, sir. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were in bed with the legends. Either that or this Captain Sarah Lance is simply screwing. <laughs> screwing? Sarah Lance? What are you <laughs> Sir, that is, that is crazy. Which is exactly what the Pentagon is going to call me, unless we find a way to justify these numbers. Got it, sir. I pride myself on being a gentleman, and the gentlemanly thing to do would be to sleep in the chair. So. <clears throat> but you, you, you can't. There's, there's no way. You, oh, that's not. Okay. Gentlemen, gentlemen, I must ask you both to calm down. Wait, no, no, no. You can't fire me. Give me one good reason why. Okay. Okay. I was going to save this for upstairs, but surprise! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. This isn't making things better, is it? No, it's fantastic. Keep going. What about you? You got any special skills? Martial arts. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's just so fresh. But Jackie Chan, you know? I prefer knives and swords. Right, yeah. Point taken. <laughs> and everyone knows that a happy mick is better for the entire ship. Whoa! Oh. Killer stash? I mean, who would ever choose to wear glass slippers and nudge on the blisters? Beer. Yes, Garima. Beer. OK. I'll do it. I'm going to let him know how I feel. <laughs> And I'm gonna go catch a serial killer. You are way too excited about this. In fact, I've never felt better in my life. Oh, that's the truth. Hear that? The truth. Something is very wrong with the president. Especially Lake Beast. Yeah, I heard she smells bad. <laughs> hey. Um. Yeah, I heard she looked really funny when she fell into the water. <laughs> but you're lucky she didn't catch pneumonia. That's a very serious illness. I know a woman I could stab. The rhymes with shame. Go with your heart. Oh, fairy godmother. Go find John and help him rescue Ray from hell. Ah, oh, fiddlesticks. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Oh, blimey. How long until we can get it up and running? Uh, if Mikey T and the boys work weekends, quick math in my head, two, maybe three years. Oh. Who the hell are you? Really? The dress doesn't sell it? Time to come up with a marketing plan for the happiest place on the planet. When the world needs heroes, they answer the call. We'll be at Hey World, the new adventure capital of Eastern Maryland. Where we will hit fun in the bullseye. And we'll give your children a flash of excitement. And That was good, guys. That was a good take. Yeah. That was a good. great take. What were we even fighting about all those years ago? Your compulsion for world domination and inability to accept rejection. Uh, translation, it was about a girl. Shh! I think that I hear something. Monsters! 
What do you think, White Canary? Should we show them what we got? Wait, hold on. What if, instead of showing them what we got, we ask them what they have, hmm? You mean, get to know them? Well, I hope you're feeling morally superior because we are getting our Puritan Puritan. That was too much, right? We don't want to be fighting werewolves in the Alamo. Uh... Well, it would be good for our ratings. What ratings? Oh, you don't know. The Time Bureau rates all their employees. But don't worry, we, we have a few dedicated fans. Yeah, Gary doesn't count. Who gives a damn about time pig ratings? I want dragons. Where in the woods exactly? A baseball field. Only there's no baseball field out there. Well, that's all right. Keep digging. He kept talking about making it to first base with a girl. But who plays baseball in the dark? Oh, yes, despite the constant reassurances of my wife, I know that I'm certainly only an adequate lover. Who are you guys? Monster Hunter, I just want you ladies to know you're in good hands. Gary! Close that hospital gown or I will report you to HR. Where the hell have you been all day? I don't know who I am. I don't know why anything is things. I don't know where my nipple went. Where's my nipple? Where's my nipple? Gary? <sighs> nice. We can't afford any screw ups on this one. Gotta bag this guy quick. Gotta stay sharp, you mean. I appreciate your concern, but I'll be fine. Just because Ava and I had a disagreement doesn't mean that I can't do my job. I was actually talking about the fact that we're on the outs with the Time Bureau. Yeah, and I was talking about Mona. Pretty cool for a grown woman wearing taffeta and a tiara. We'll be fine. We'll get him to the ship, fix what's wrong, and we'll be right back. John, see if you can figure out what's wrong with Nixon, and Mona, find us something to wear. Charlie. We forgot Charlie! After your recent unfortunate misadventures in time travel, I created a team-building card game to help you learn the do's and don'ts of our prior missions. I'm calling it Cards to Save the Timeline. Fun way to learn from your mistakes, right? Oh, you gotta be joking. Vandal Savage. That's a real name. And here's me thinking that Damien Dark's Monaco is a touch on the now. What the hell is going on here? <sighs> Checkers. Exactly. And when I pointed that out, Ava shut me down. Not to stereotype, but I think a clone might have replaced her, and we need to look into it. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. <laughs> okay. Let's go now. <laughs> I cannot marry you, Mr. Doherty. My heart yearns for another. Our family scullery maid. Alan, are you here? I'm here. I love you too. I give not one fig, Miss Sinclair, for my heart and my lower extremities yearn for your mother. Get over here, gorgeous. Now this is what I call a wedding. Like a handsome coachman, perhaps? Hmm? Fine, I'll go ask him some questions. But that's it. You go get it, girl. Okay. Uh, guys, okay. I, I feel like that would have worked a little bit better with the real Trinity. Yeah, well, I asked, and they said, hard pass. We should have done a crossover. Yeah. <sighs> Damn it, this is definitely a dream. Gideon, where's that music coming from? I took the liberty of broadcasting Mr. Marcy's comms. Huh, it's rather infectious. Ray, 
this music. I think it's magical. You're right. I want to express my feelings to you in verse. Is that really necessary? I've got it! Natori! I'm gonna regret asking this, but what's that? That's your couple's name. Not for Nate, and of course, Ari is for you. You know I'm a superhero, right? With a flick on my wrist, I can blast you with my wind powers. Being honest, wind powers, just not that scary. Yeah, you're like a magical hair dryer. What is this, Legend's Eye for the straight guy? You're straight. Where's Sarah? Her soul is trapped in limbo. And I am right there with her. You don't even date humans. Love's love. I'm here. Why is Gary in your subconscious? I may have some Gary issues that need working out. Oh. <coughs> Mikey T. <coughs> I gotta stop him. You know, we should probably talk about whether or not we want kids. Uh, let's wait until the other eight are old enough to handle the news. I thought it was gonna take all week. That's great. It means you won't have to miss book club tonight. That's right. Mm -hmm. Book club. Page one. We'll have to wait. Let's do this. Okay, page one. Is this an audiobook? They say your life flashes before your eyes when you die. But what if in that moment, you finally see everything life's been trying to show you? That's how I discovered that a killer was amongst me. I should have known something was amiss that night. I was returning from hot yoga to my sensational cliffside home, matcha green tea smoothie in hand, when I noticed my door was slightly ajar. I entered, wondering if my dog walker or cat sitter or personal shopper or astrologer had failed to close it. That's when I heard him say, there's something I've been meaning to kill you. Okay, so, hmm. What did you think of the book? Oh, you want to keep doing book club? Babe, we don't have to. We can just forget it. I thought it would be nice for us to be able to do something of yours. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. I didn't read the book. What? Sorry. Seriously? Honestly, I, I usually just drink rosé and let Mona go on and on and use it as a mini vacay for my brain. Well, it was actually a really good book. Wait, 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 you, uh, come on. I can still drink rosé and we can go on and on. Hmm, come on. Come on. Okay, fine. So, I think the real killer was the dog walker. No. I bet you 20 bucks they hook up on the mission. I will take that. See, they took care of things on their own, and they were clearly about to hook up. No, they weren't. Wait. You owe me 20 bucks. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Were you guys about to hook up? It was no, definitely no, 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 on the no. table. See? Yeah. Come on, I told you. It doesn't matter. Oh, chit chat with a bunch of weirdos dressed as some ridiculous alien queen they all want to bang. <laughs> no problem. Okay, I'll judge this round. You and your team are stuck in a trash compactor in an impromptu and possibly fatal homage to Star Wars. What do you do? Boom. That's the one. Yep. Ooh, we're gonna have to go with steal up as Sarah scales the wall. Another point for me. Favoritism! Why would I display favoritism? Because you two are obviously shagging. What? Huh? It's... Yeah. Yes! Finally! This is great. Maybe you guys won't be so weird now. Just be normal. You can be normal. Because you are normal. Next! Come on! <laughs> oh, damn it, Gary! Now I'm powerless. Director Sharp, I've been waiting for you. Uh, Gary, I told you no playing with my chair until after hours. Were you about to apologize? Only because Charlie was catfishing me. Tabitha, show yourself. <sighs> so wonderful to be back. Brimstone was so awful for my complexion. Oh, but you look ravishing, my love. Mm. Hold on. Is he... Kissing? Oh, the fairy godmother. Is that tongue? War singing. We're so screwed. It's his nipple. He tried to hypnotize Mona with his nipple. Nick, Nate, you think you can handle Tabitha? Granny's dead. Article 27? Hmm? A supervisor must never show favoritism? You started a book club with another employee. Gary. Uh, oh. 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 Oh
It was terrible. Oh, my head. That's the spirit. Get it? Keep common pastry on. Ah, <laughs> good one, Cap. Good one. Hilarious. I'll take good care of her. Them. Five, six, seven, eight. Faster. Gary, stop it! Faster! You missed calls from Barry Allen, Oliver Queen, and Cara Zorel. Sounds like the annual crossover. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be a hard pass. Oh, easy for you to say. At least you had a future. When I was a kid, my dad convinced me to be a demon vessel. You think it was easy for me? At least you got to be a kid. Try being a clone from 2213, okay? The only taste of childhood I've ever had was almost being killed by a striga at summer camp. Damn it. Who told Ava about the dragon? Where is he? Nice work, sorry, Cat. Those girls are monsters! Out of the way, suckers. Make way for SOS. What the hell is SOS? some mysteries we give bad guys the boot in superhero suits we'll win a victory by stopping witchery so they've got magic well we've got hard and fabric puppets of tomorrow puppets of tomorrow today welcome to dc's puppets of tomorrow Lake Beast, Lake Beast, Lake Beast. It allows us to form a meaningful connection and them to feel like they're part of a team. They aren't going to be a part of anything if they're dead. Not Nora. Hi. <clears throat> Not Nora. Not Nora. Definitely not Nora. Ray, I really don't need to hear your inner dialogue. Sorry, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous and upset. I mean, how could she be so heartless? Pun not intended. Well, her father did give her over to a demon-loving cult, so... Oh, hush, it's still me, despite the insane grin on my face. <laughs> Wait, stop right there. Are you... me? Yes. From the future. <gasps> Do I ever find love? Or at least my sunglasses. They might be in my other pants. Red alert. Nate is on the ship. And he brought his dad for what's gotta be a surprise inspection. <clears throat> We're so not ready for guests. Nate's here? I could really use a hug and get his advice on Nora. That is some great A magic right there. Maybe the Bureau will up our ratings. People do love the supernatural. Explain to me how this magicometer of yours works. Oh, well. I think it goes beep and we kick ass. Meaning we investigate each time period. Oh, we find the creature. We bring it to the Bureau. And hopefully learn some life lessons along the way. But this is really good. Uh, I confiscated it from Alexis. Well, here's proof. A unicorn ate my nipple. <gasps> <coughs> Gary, baby, Bobby, Bubala. Hey. You did it. No. We did it. We did it. <sighs> Just one final ingredient. I trust you'll find that my potion is magical. Oh, you call that soup? Ugh. 
The whole cradle of punk rock and the stickiest floor in the British Isles. Sounds lovely. You kids have fun. I'll have a bottle of hand sanitizer when you come back. Now, where did your mate Zach run off to last night? He didn't say. But I hope he didn't go near the outdoor showers. Why? What's by the outdoor showers? That's where I hit my Victoria's Secret catalog. <sighs> Mr. Mars, the prisoner is growing quite unruly. Tell her to knock herself out. There are no conjugal visits. Wait, what? You think that I want to visit Nora so that we can... We... I just want to make sure that she's okay. Oh, that is so sweet. I almost believe that story, you big, lovable teddy bear, you. But the answer is still no. Here, use words. It's erotic, but vulnerable. Okay, let me see it. <clears throat> I'm not saying Paul. That's your ID picture. You wouldn't let me retake it. Oh, it can't be that bad. Let me see. Uh, maybe we'll just use your photo from the wanted poster. And that'll teach those bad guys that crime doesn't pay. Wait, 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 wait. Blondes killed in locked rooms. That's the ammo of Mike the Spike. Am I gonna find a murder board in your closet? New Orleans is a cr... I didn't catch your name. Ray. Rage? Yep, rage. That's what they call me. On account of all my various rages uh, against um, the machine. Wow. Oh. <clears throat> and as we say at the Time Bureau, the adventure's in the details. Rory, do you see any virgins where you're at? No. Excuse me. Okay. Hi. Excuse me, son. Hi, pardon me. I'm sorry. I just um, I don't belong here. No, and um, I'm a I'm a fairy godmother sent to find John Constantine. Look, son, I don't know who put you up to this. But Oh yeah. I'm also a superhero. And this is my friend Ray. Oh, hi, Mr. Haywood. Nice to finally meet you. So the bride and the scullery maid, that was insane. Romantic. I was gonna say hot. And Councilor John is missing already. See how easy it is to get lost in the woods, gentlemen. Well, at least your family are real people. Minor actors. My friends and I here are time travelers. We've kidnapped Nixon and we're headed to Disney World. You sure you're okay, Director Sharp? I'm fine! I'm just taking some time to get my head together after Sarah was unicorned. And this is where Nate would say, I'm your buddy, and we do a fist bump or a silly jig or... You know what you need? You need to be a part of a team. Uh, yeah. uh... You were saying... 